uh, you know, now in this last-ditch effort. Well, let's lie to uh, senior citizens and scare them to death with lies about Republicans. They want to take away your Social Security and Medicare and cut it. Okay, not a single Republican has ever said it. No Republican supports it. It will be my objective to phase out Social Security, nice. to pull it up by the roots and get rid of it. Entitlements are going to consume the budget. Right now, we're at 2050, we're going to have 185% of debt to GDP. Medicare and Social Security and other entitlement programs are worth saving, are going to consume the debt. We're down to a small fraction of the the federal pie to run the discretionary part of government. So entitlement reform is a must for us to not become Greece. Yes, and you know, defense spending has always been discretionary. The VA spending is discretionary. What's mandatory are things like Social Security and Medicare. If, if you qualify for the entitlement, you just get it no matter what the cost. And our problem in this country is that more than 70% of our federal budget, of our federal spending, is all mandatory spending. It's on automatic pilot. It, it never, you just don't do proper oversight. You don't get in there and fix the programs going bankrupt. It's just an automatic pilot. What we ought to be doing is we ought to turn everything into discretionary spending so it's all evaluated so that we, we can't fix problems or fix programs that are broken that are going to be going bankrupt. But no. Because, again, as long as things are on automatic pilot, we just continue to pile up debt. It's mortgage our kids' future. It's this massive debt burden. Okay, first off, you recently put out an 11-point plan to rescue America, two of the big points of which are, quote, all Americans should pay some income tax to have skin in the game, even if a small amount. Currently, over half of Americans pay no income tax. It also says all federal legislation sunsets in five years. If a law is worth keeping, Congress can pass it again. So that would raise taxes on half of Americans and potentially sunset programs like Medicare, Medicaid, and Social Security. Why would you propose something like that in an election year? Sure. Well, John, that's, of course, the Democrat talking points. It's a no, 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 it's plan. in the plan. <laughs> it's in well, the plan. It, but, it, here's, here, but here's this thing about reality for a second. It's First of all, let's talk but, about but, Medicare. But, Senator, but Senator hang on. John. Hang on. So it's not a Democratic talking point. It's in the plan. Atlanta. Early voting ends tomorrow. So you have today and tomorrow to get your early vote in. Everybody listening to me needs to vote blue up and down the ticket. 